there's a cloud. Ah. Remember when he mentioned plumbing issues? That's this. This makes really good fart noises. <laughs> I don't know why I'm switching plungers. <laughs> Be clean. See, Jonathan has this, and I'm going to call it an irrational fear, John. It's, I think it's more. Oh god, what happened here? Okay. More of a it's what? A, it's a sensory thing. Okay. We, we both have sensory things that annoy us. Like, for example, I have to have my socks all the way tight, otherwise I get all OCD and can be sent into a panic attack. Same with my um, my sleeves under the arms. They have to be loose because I feel confined otherwise. John, on the other hand, can't have things touch his hands or his arms. Can't wear long sleeves. Can't have dogs, like, lick his hand. It's hard for him to even let them uh, sniff his hands. So he is, has his hands... In a goo of sorts. Got Drano and dirt. And shower cleaner. Potentially raw sewage. This is why I'm not a plumber. So, I've established that he needs to shower later at my I house. I needed to shower later, long before you established that. <laughs> no, you established that you needed a decontamination shower as well as being burned with fire to make it purely sanitized. <laughs> All right, guys, um, we're, we're going to sit and cry here for a second because we just filmed, like, a five-minute segment, and we're going to have to reiterate what we just said. But it was really funny and, and my, spontaneous. It was, a good, it was a good take, and my phone did awesome. not save it. I'm having trouble with it writing files to my SD card. <laughs> so John and I are plunging the uh, sink, and draining slowly, draining slowly, and it's been... It took, like, 45 minutes yeah, to Yeah, it. it was about 45 minutes to <laughs> drain it from, like, <laughs> halfway full. And, um, so we're plunging and our friend Ashley is, um, is saying, I can hear water, so, so it's a good thing it's moving. She's checking to make sure that it's doing something. Yeah. To see if she can hear stuff moving. And we're like, yeah, okay, it's coming from the utility room, which is where, you know. Where all the water lines are. So we're like, okay, this is working, let's get, keep going. So John and I are plunging and we think we're getting somewhere and all of a sudden we hear a whoosh and a splash. And then we're going... There should be no splash. What's with the splash? There's we, nowhere we, to splash. Hearing a whoosh is good. That means water's moving. The splash means the water's moving outside of a pipe. But what's funny is the moment we heard the splash, all the water drained down. <laughs> it all went down. And so we walk back in the utility room, and there's water all over the wall <laughs> from the pipe where the washer is supposed to connect to that didn't have a cap. It's, where, it's the, the washer drain pipe, and it, apparently something was backed up to where where the sink was draining, and we were plunging it. It was like doing an old faithful in my utility room, trying <laughs> to sanitize the wall with dishwater. And we we got in there and we're looking around at all the water. We figured out why the drain suddenly drained so quickly. So quackly. So quackly. We figured out why why they were draining so quickly now. Because there was like a fist size gob of unknown papery substance. Wait, 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 wait. wait. And my fist, not her fist. Not my fist. There's this gob of paper. We're not sure if it's toilet paper or I don't want to know what it is. All I I know what it is. It's still there, I think. All I know is he has to clean it up because it's his house. And uh And um it it wasn't But you have to understand, it's, it, it's the water wasn't just splashing and then rolling down the floor. That's not what, what was happening. The water was just splashing and then pooling. The paper was like halfway across the room. Like it had <laughs> shot out of this thing. Which means it decided <laughs> to become like Bullet Bill from Mario. <laughs> so let's go. And then shoot across the room. So, in, in the end, the sinks still don't drain correctly. The shower does not drain correctly. I found a new leak under my bathroom sink. And so nothing is fixed. So we just kind of gave up. Came back to her house, ate, ate potato soup. Now we're gonna hang out and watch Pirates of the Caribbean, um, like the dorks that we are. And I think that's pretty much the plan. I've tried to watch this movie several times over the past week, but I keep watching it too late at night to where I know that I'm not gonna remember it in the morning. And so I have to just turn off because I'm not gonna remember the movie. And I still, even right now, I don't remember all of the movie. So this will it's gonna be a new experience. And she's um, watching the Right. This is cheap. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> On that note, we're going to watch the movie. <laughs> Alright, so once again, I realized that either I lost the footage from Ice Sign Off or I didn't film it. I'm editing a video from a day or two ago. And I don't see footage for a sign off, so I'm going to film one right now. It's from the one where we were watching Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, basically, we watched Pirates of the Caribbean. I almost fell asleep at the end because I was very, 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 very tired. Um, but it was a very good movie. I, I recommend it to anyone who is a fan of those movies. I, a lot of people said that it wasn't that good, but I thought it was pretty well done. As, as Bailey put it, it's kind of a different brand. All the other Pirates of the Caribbean movies focused on Keira Knightley and some other characters. This one, like Johnny Depp, just puked all over the entire movie, and it's awesome. So if, if you're a fan of Johnny Depp, watch it. Uh, but anyway, so thank you guys for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will try to remember to film my sign-offs and make sure I save that footage. And I will see you guys tomorrow.